guys welcome back to my daily ramadan vlogs today i'm gonna take you on a little adventure we're dropping felipe off to the vet he's gonna be fixed he started spraying and he's making a mess of things bless him he's like super super cute and has no idea what's going on and then we're gonna go pick up a few things for the house if you're new to my page welcome i do daily vlogs for ramadan and also beauty tutorials cooking tutorials fun things like that just lifestyle content make sure you hit the subscribe button and join the family hey guys all right so we are off to the vet felipe has started spraying um and we've like isolated him to one room until we got him fixed so we managed to squeeze in an appointment within two days of finding out that he's starting to spray we are taking him to his vet appointment now are we late so I made this mask with an old sock. Maybe I'll do a little tutorial. You'll be alright. You'll be allowed back in the hostel. Yeah, you'll be allowed back in. Uh, Hopefully you'll be less crazy. Yeah, less aggressive. I'm really liking the sock mask I made you. How come yours isn't covered in lint and mine is? Because you're crazy cat lady. What? You crazy cat lady. What accent is that? I crazy cat lady accent. You look insane. Especially <laughs> when you say it like that. This one. This one. This. <laughs> so we just dropped Felipe off. We are going to pop into Poundland and get some cleaning cleaning supplies. That's the word. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what's the word? This sock was a good but bad idea because i'm covered in john yeah give me yours yo allow it allow it bruv yo you got the best one this is what i need all of this this stuff excellent this scent fresh linen perfect you know what what the heck I really don't like the smell of this. This makes me sick. Like, I can't smell it at all. So I need to find a new floor cleaner. Oh, it's like it new. Perfect. I love this stuff. These. This may seem excessive, but one for each bathroom, so it's not. And I only do this maybe like once every three, four months. So basically the new rug that I set up in Adam's room smells like new rug. So I'm trying to get the scent out and I'm going to use bicarbonate soda, but let's try this as well. Oh, yeah, this seems interesting. So I want to get some snacks for the pantry. These M&Ms are excellent. The pretzel ones, mmm, good for the fridge, just to organize a few things. We have a tiny fridge, but I mean, we don't even have any one. Oh my god, I needed plain flour. Let me get some of these. Do they have them in black? No, it's fine. If it's, if it's blonde, then I don't lose them as much. Too happy with my chocolates and candy, yo. No, I only got a couple things. Yeah, you like two bag ones. They're for you. They're your surprise. I have a few pairs of shades in the car, and I'm gonna do a try-on haul with the car shades that I have. Okay, so we got these ones. These ones are from a sunglass spot. They're just blue light resistant. Then we got the one Amir stole from me. Okay. This one used to be a favorite until it just went missing. Did it? How did I get here? I don't know. I 
know. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, some trippy stuff happening, yo. He feels so cool. Like, you can just see his ego get so big. And you can tell he's worn it because he stretched the heck out of it. With his big face. I don't know driving here to be like, bopping to music that is not even playing. Last but not least, super cute. They're like squarish. They look very vintage-y. But I have these ones in black. Woo! Those ones. That's right. Oh yeah. We're nearly home. Thanks for watching this sunglass tutorial. I'm starting to lose my mind. <laughs> John, do you mind? John. John, do you mind? Okay, you guys, I'm gonna show you all the things that I got from the pound store. Just because I find these types of videos interesting, I'm assuming that you would. First thing I got was for my refrigerator. It is this kitchen organizing container. Let me open it up. Everything is a little damp because I sprayed it all down with this hole. So these compartments, this one is meant to be for jars and this one's meant to be for like cans of Coke or whatever you want to put in them. But um, they just organize the fridge a lot better. And you know what, with these compartments, they make you fit way more things in a tiny fridge. I can't stand Adam's toys. They just go off whenever they feel like it. 2 a.m., 5 a.m., random times of the day. It just goes off and nobody asked it to. Nobody touched it. Pretty much it for compartments. I also got these stainless steel bowls. I have big versions of these, but they're not from the same brand. I like how it has the rubber base so that it doesn't really slide anywhere. So I got a ton of cleaning supplies. I love to clean my home. I don't like, actually, that's a lie. I don't like cleaning my home, actually. But I like buying cleaning supplies. I like scrubbing cleaning. I don't like organizing cleaning. Do you know what I mean? Like, I honestly would hate hate to organize my closet but when it comes to cleaning the bathrooms and the kitchen I actually enjoy that because the idea of just like having it sparkling clean and like killing all the bacteria makes me happy the idea of organizing my things and folding things makes me physically sick so um it's usually the other way around but no not with me like cleaning my makeup organizing my makeup literally makes me sick like I hate it I just want it to just be organized I got this Dettol surface cleaner I love these especially when I'm like chopping chicken I put all the chicken juice things, that sounds so gross, <laughs> but all the chicken juice things in the sink. I like to just spray down the counter, wipe it down before I go into cleaning the things that have chicken on them. Even the sink, I would just, with the bowls in there that have the chicken residue, I would spray everything down first and then I would go in and clean it. I also found the Dittal Nutra Air, which is like an air neutralizer. I love the Sif Perfect Finish Oven and Grill Cleaner. I have one for stainless steel. It leaves your stainless steel sparkling. You don't need to go in with another cleaner. You could literally, with the grease spots and everything, after I've cleaned the counters and everything, I go in with this, with the stainless steel version, and I clean the oven top. I clean my coffee machine Nespresso, because that's stainless steel. And if you have a stainless steel fridge, and you don't want streaks, floor cleaner. I hate the smell of flash floor cleaner. I feel like it just smells so so hospitally so like oh it just does not smell like lemon to me it just smells like medicine so i stopped buying those ones and even the flash wipes that are lemon anything flash lemon i got some rub in the tub so these are like gloves that exfoliate for when you take a shower i love buying these for my guests when they come in they could just use this and then dispose of it i have some i actually don't i haven't used this in a long time i had one that i've rinsed from Primark, it was excellent. It was panda bear ears. It was literally the perfect shower cap. But this is a good hair shower cap. Please feel free to skip this if you're super bored. I find these things so interesting. <laughs> we have Zaflora. I love Zaflora. And I only buy the linen fresh one because I love the smell of like linen fresh, cotton. I like the, the clean home smells. I don't like lavender. It, it smells like someone sneezed. After I've cleaned the bathroom, after I've cleaned the toilet or the sink, I take a cap full and I just drip it into the sink or into the toilet or into the bathtub and just let it, let it just soak into the down the pipes and it just leaves such a clean smell. Vical, which is like a lime skill remover. If you live in the UK, the water is so harsh. It's so hard. You literally have a lime skill day where you go into your sinks, your bathrooms, and you spray it down. Your shower, if you have a glass shower wall, it will be covered in lime scale within one or two uses of the shower. It's crazy. Like maintenance on lime skill, it's crazy. And some people that just don't care have lime skill built up in their bathrooms. I've seen some horrific British bathrooms where I'm like, 
well obviously Canada bathrooms are gross too some some of them are really disgusting but lime scale is like a different issue here so you have to actually maintain it on a weekly basis when you wash your bathrooms you have to actually like take care of lime scale some hair bands this is a pack of 50 and this was a pound this looks interesting this is a stain bar fabric stain remover but in a bar so it's like a soap bar but you rub it on a stain before you wash it i got some fairy liquid anything that's not fairy liquid doesn't work we have some toilet cleaner this is the duck dissolves lime scale in the scent pine this is new eliminates odors so basically upstairs in adam's room we have a new rug and it's so beautiful so flush but it actually smells like new rug so i want to put this on there and then vacuum it maybe add some if it hasn't like completely gone we have some gloves in the size large because i got some big man hands toilet bowl cleaner i haven't tried this before but i've tried the pink stuff actual pink stuff like the tub of pink stuff and this is the miracle multi-purpose cleaner pink stuff is perfect for getting stains out of my, my tiles and stuff it really just gets everything out but this is the spray version i think this one i got the airwake pure neutralizing odors this one was two pounds that's all for cleaning supplies so i'm just gonna pop this back in so now we're gonna go into snacks. Most of these things I have to hide from Amir because he tends to go into the garage and eat it all. So first thing, Amir really likes these. It's the Max Strong Perfect with Beer Hot Chicken Wings. Well, we don't drink, but hot chicken wings flavored chips. These are from Walkers, AKA Lay's. These are the Oats So Simple Quaker Oats Golden Syrup. Love, love, love these quick and easy oatmeals. I love oatmeal for breakfast actually. I got these brioche buns with chocolate chip. My mother-in-law loves these. My friends Mims and Shop absolutely love these. These are the crispy M&Ms. So I bought them to put in my garage so when they come out I could pull them out for them. Bell Vita breakfast milk and cereal bars. My brother-in-law likes this so whenever he visits, whenever this lockdown is over. These are nice actually. Actually like grandma I feel like these are like what like old people would like, but it's actually quite delicious. My sister-in-law likes these chips, um, the cheddar and onion, so I bought them for her. <laughs> I feel like I'm so antisocial. Like, look at this. I didn't realize that I put these things in my basket for other people, but I did. Inshallah, she'll come soon once this lockdown is over. These look delicious. I actually tried one since I'm not fasting. The, the Lotus Biscoff with Belgium chocolates on the back. It is really good. Some Lenore for tumble drying sheets. I actually like to put this in my cupboards. So I folded a bunch of Adam's laundry. I would put this in the cupboard and then I would insert the sheets in between. This is the only one I like and it's the Spring Awakening. I haven't tried this before, but it's their rice pudding, creamy and delicious, 123 calories per pot. Everybody loves these. These are the Kinder chocolate bar. Sasha really loves these. So when she comes over, she can have some. I bought two packs. I got some flour. I'm going to try. I'm so excited. So excited. I want to film this. I'm going to try the pancake bake from Nadia's cooking show. It's like this big pot that's like a cake, but it's a pancake. And you put like peanut butter and jelly on top. And it's just, it looks so delicious. So I'm going to try that out. And I needed more flour. Also to make some crispy chicken. I got these peanut covered M&Ms. Dark milk, giant buttons, rich and creamy. Actually, I really wanted to try this. Oh my god, these are really good. They taste like truffle. They're not like too dark, you know? These are some oven mitts I picked up. And last but not least, I have these two glass mason jars. Is this a mason jar? Just a jar to put beans and things in. I like the sizes of these. I don't have this size. I think it's a perfect size to put like cocoa powder, beans, chia seeds, you know? I hope you enjoyed my home haul cleaning and snack supplies from the dollar store, pound store, dollar plus, dollarama, wherever you are in the world. I'm gonna go and refresh the carpets and vacuum and just get my day started because I need to feel productive today. So I'm just going around the house, trying to clean all the windows that I could reach. Wow, what a difference it made. Like you could definitely see through the window. <laughs> So I'm just in the cleaning mood. So I'm gonna go inside, I'm gonna mop all the floors on the main floor, 
clean the ground floor bathroom and then see how much energy I have to go up stairs. Let's go. Okay, so Felipe is back in the vet, and he limps when he walks. Lipstick has completely rubbed off. I topped up on my SPF because it is a beautiful sunny day today. We decided to just go for a little stroll. Nothing is matching, and it's just totally okay. Right, Baba? Adam? <gasps> Do you like this? You know what? The sun's not in his face at all. This hat is amazing. Okay guys, this is today's iftar. I made some butter chicken. I have the recipe up on my YouTube page. I will link it down in the description box. My mom-in-law made the most delicious okra. Oh, it was so, so good. Perfectly cooked. Um, I'll film a tutorial on this because we haven't filmed it, but oh my God, it's so good. Some white rice and some naan and some chapati. Okay, you guys, so I wanted to introduce you to this week's giveaway. I did one last week and it was a smashing hit. Just before we start, I wanted to explain that you have to be 18 or over and these are universal giveaways. So I'm sending this to wherever you are in the world globally. So I have my two favorite pair of lashes. These are the lashes that I wear in 90% of my tutorials. Excuse my nails, they're just a hot mess right now. But these are the most like fluffiest, gorgeous lashes ever from Tati Lashes. It's in the style TL3 and TL9. You heard me talk about the Caudalie Even Perfect line. This is one of my favorite skincares, and this is the anti-aging night cream. I actually already gave away the serum, so this is a night cream. Excellent, super hydrating, and it helps with dark spots and melasma, any type of discoloration you may have. I have all the packaging here. I just took it out just so it could be easier to explain. This is a Laura Mercier bronzer in the shade Soleil One. It's quite light, so I would say it's for light to medium complexions, but you could also use it as a eyeshadow these literally have just come out it's the fenty beauty cream blushes they literally came out like a week ago and it's in the shade coco berry crush on cupid and we have the shade drama class now i don't want to swatch them because they're brand new another thing that recently came out with fenty beauty with this line i think correct me if i'm wrong it's this body illuminator it's in cognac candy which is this beautiful bronze we also have a lip balm stick by code 8 it's an am pm lip balm stick so you can use that as your night lip balm or you can use it during the day we also have a lip shade that i think you guys would really like from code 8 as well it is in the color matte velour contouring lipstick in lima i think beautiful sweat a little bit because it was just the pack all these packagings were just in the sun for a second it's like this beautiful brownie nude color super pretty we also have this darphine aromic cleansing balm with rosewood i actually bought this i didn't get around to using it just because i have so many opened cleansing balms already so i'm trying to go through them but i will give this away and just repurchase it and try it out for myself but i don't know how this works but this brand is exceptional. I love their SPF. We also have the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Recovery Power Foil Mask. This is excellent. It's funny because the first time I wore this, I actually took the foil off, but you're supposed to keep it on. And then last but not least, we have this Avita Damage Remedy Daily Hair Repair. So you put this on damp hair and it's supposed to like instantly help with damaged hair. So any hijabis out there that are struggling with their hair, a good one. Also, if you're in this Makeup brush by Fenty, the 125 one. If you wanna enter, comment down below and tell me one thing you love about yourself and another thing you love about someone else. Tag the person you're talking about or mention their name. It doesn't have to be a full name, you know, for privacy reasons. I just wanted to spread some love. So you do that, you're over 18 and no matter where you are in the world, you will be entered in this competition. And I will tell you who the winner is on my community tab on my YouTube page. So stay tuned for that. Yeah.